morning. We welcome you uh, to worship this morning, and we want to remind you that this Sunday uh, we have our first in-person worship out on the property, and so we hope that you'll be joining us for that uh, promptly at 9 a.m., so we're asking people to come between 8 and 8.45 to set up. Uh, but we look forward to seeing you, and it's good to see you this morning. We're going to take a, a look at the book of Acts today, the second chapter, the first five verses. And when the day of Pentecost had come, uh, they were all together in one place, and suddenly there came from heaven a noise like a violent rushing wind, and it filled the whole house where they were sitting. And there appeared to them tongues as of fire, distributing themselves, and they rested on each of them. And they were all filled with the Holy Spirit and began to speak with other tongues as the Spirit was giving them utterance. Now there were Jews living in Jerusalem, devout men from every nation under heaven. Former Newsboys uh, lead vocalist Peter Fuller describes the performance of the band's praise song, He Reigns. The song paints a vivid picture of believers from every tribe and nation coming together to worship God in unity. Furler observed that whenever the newsboys sang it, he could sense the moving of the Holy Spirit in the gathering of the believers. Furler's description of his experiences with He Reigns would likely have resonated with the crowds who converged on Jerusalem at the time of Pentecost. When the disciples were filled with the Holy Spirit, things began to happen beyond anyone's experience. As a result, Jews representing every nation came together in confusion because each one heard their own language being spoken to make God's wonders known. Peter explained to the crowd that this was in fulfillment of the Old Testament prophecy in which God said, I will pour out my spirit on all people. This all-inclusive display of God's awesome power made the crowd receptive to Peter's declaration of the gospel, leading to 3,000 converts that particular day. Following this spectacular kickoff, these new believers then returned to their corner of the world, taking the good news with them. The good news still resounds today. In the midst of all that we're dealing with, it resounds today. God's message of hope for all people. As we praise God together, his spirit moves among us, bringing people of every nation together in wonderful unity. Yes, he reigns. Questions for you this morning. In what ways do you see God's image in other people? And how can you view people from every tribe and every nation through the lens of Jesus? Pray with me. Dear Heavenly God, help me to reflect your heart for all of your people this day. Amen.